Number 5 Windows Me Windows Me was an unfinished version of Windows. That was put into use for the big computer firms such as Dell and HP so they would have a product to be able to sell their Millennium product which turned into a huge flop for Microsoft. Mainly it's a tuned down version of Windows 98 without the drivers needed. Number 4 Nokia Symbian Symbian does not have cool apps. If we compare the applications with Android and its Symbian does not withstand the race. Maybe Nokia Store has a bigger collection than Android or Apple Store but it doesn't mean that every app works perfectly for the devices. It is very difficult to imagine a mobile device which does not have good apps. The Nokia Store is good but really ancient. Most of the applications in Nokia Store are slow, leggy and have a horrible interface. Article Source HTTP colon slash slash as in articles dot com slash seven oh three nine oh two six number three MS DOS four zero because very few new programs available therefore you need to be able to write programs in many cases not nearly as fancy in the graphics department not compatible with current browsers and most internet it's a single user OS it's a single tasking OS it does not support graphics, it does not support networking. Number 2 Lindos Lindos original claim was to have a Linux distribution that can run Windows software. Except that it doesn't really work. This week however they announced that they plan to become more of a vanilla distribution like Red Hat, SUS and Mandrake and now no one really knows what's the point in Lindos anymore. Number 1 Windows Vista this drawbacks associated with this. 1. Requirements high. The graphics card requirement is quite high. The graphics card must be of DirectX 10 supported. The required minimum graphics memory on the graphics card is 128 megabytes. For better performance, graphics memory must be of 256 megabytes. 2. Issue with the driver's compatibility. One of the common issue with the Windows Vista is that the device drivers compatible for Windows Vista are not released by all the manufacturers of the hardwares. 3. Regarding price, the price for Windows Vista editions are also high. Ordinary users cannot thus have a look into all the features of Vista, which is only available in the Ultimate Edition.